sorry there was no video yesterday. Well, I mean, technically there was one that I guess technically went up yesterday, but it was filmed the night before, but, um, I don't know. I just really wasn't feeling it. Like, not really properly depressed exactly. Like, honestly, I'm still kind of feeling that way today. I'm just making myself film anyway. But not really properly depressed. I don't feel sick. I can't blame it on the heat, because I've got the air conditioner on. It's like, you look. It is 76 right now, so I can't blame it on that. I don't I don't know, I'm just kind of not feeling it. And you know, when you're not feeling it, it's sometimes, sometimes it makes it better to force yourself through it and do it anyway, and you find that it cheers you up, and other times it's better to just sit it out and give yourself an off day. And the latter is what I did yesterday, and the former is what I'm trying to do today and hoping for the best. Um, I don't know, maybe, maybe I'm just moody, because it's like that time of the month. Actually, Actually, come to think of it, that's probably exactly it, and I'm just an idiot that it took till, like, this second for it to dawn on me that, hey, I bet that's what's actually wrong with me. Huh. Imagine that. Hold on just a second. Okay, sorry, I don't even remember where I left off now, but, um, I think I, like, left off just, yeah, figuring out, I think my moodiness is just because I'm on the rack, and then on top of that, I just hitting despair every time I so much as walk past a mirror because I'm so bloated I look like I'm fucking two months preg or some shit like like no really no I am not even fucking kidding you it is disgusting I will even show you guys how disgusting I am right now like can can we see this this is no bueno why why is this a thing this is not supposed to be a thing fuck that Ugh. just it needs to go away, and it needs to go away now, and I am not loving this, and just, uh, I mean, I realize I have no room to bitch. Most people have much better things to whine about when it's that time of the month. Like, most people get cramps. I'm the lucky bitch who doesn't, really. I mean, if I do, they're so minimal, I don't even take anything. They're more just an annoyance, so. Yeah, could be a lot worse. I'm just, I have body dysmorphia enough to wear... It fucks with me if anything makes it look like I have more weight on than I actually do. So just, I don't know, that's probably not helping my freaking mood any, or just, uh, whatever. Anyway, so, one good thing, though, in doing this review, it's the very last one of these. Once I plow through this one, I never have to talk about these fucking things again. They'll just be done, and we for can just forget that I wasted $70 on a set of products that suck and just yeah that even it's taken me over a year to work my way through them all 10 of them to review i am more than happy to be fucking done with this so anyway this one is the covergirl o sugar in number 10 gumdrop and ta dunk I don't even know. I went ahead and took off the sticker before I started, so we don't have to sit here and awkwardly watch me do that. So yeah, um, anyway, we're gonna get into it. Format-wise, it's basically like a lipstick, even though it's a tinted lip balm. If it would fucking open- okay, I'm sorry. Sorry. Um, yeah, it just looks like a- that's really dark. Holy shit. <laughs> like, I wasn't expecting quite that dark. Oh boy! Oh boy, this, this is gonna be fun! I'm gonna look like a fucking vampire, which actually that might not be so bad. I might enjoy that, but anyway, um, packaging wise, just a cub cubicular sphere? No, not sphere! Fuck! Cubicular cylinder. That's what I'm looking for, because it's square like a cube, but it, it's still a tube, like a cylinder. I don't really know what the fuck to call this, but I don't know. It's got an acrylic base, it's got stuff, it's got the vitamin-infused balm on the back. Can you tell how not into this I am? This holy balls, I don't even... Whatever, whatever. Um. These are not natural or organic. I don't think anybody ever thought they were. I'm gonna fix thing with this. Um, I don't think they're limited edition, but it is part of a set of 10, and this is number 10, so at least it's finally the last one I could cry. I won't cry, though, so, um, 
amount of product isn't listed. I think it's 0.12 ounces, though, if I remember right. I kind of just want to Like, honestly, just holding it like that, I was like, I have the overwhelming urge to just chuck it across the room as hard as I can. Yeah, I have issues. Just throwing that out there. All right, so... Apparently, I'm just in, like, a violent, moody mood, apparently. Not towards other people, just inanimate objects, don't worry, but... Fuck. Oh, my God. Um. Yeah, shelf life, not listed. Who cares? Who cares? It sucks anyway. It's gonna get one use and probably sit at the bottom of a bag for the rest of all eternity. Um, price point was terrible. I paid $7 for this little fucker. Apparently you could get it less or for more, depending where you bought it. Just depends. I bought it at Target where I could buy the whole set in one fell swoop instead of having to buy some here, some there, some everywhere, and just, it was easier. But it cost more, and I'm hating myself for wasting all that money on it, but if I had bought the cheaper ones, it would have cost the same for the shipping from all the different places to get them for those lower prices, so it still would have been freaking $70. It might have even been more. I don't know. But yeah, so sturdiness-wise, yeah, it's sturdy. Just hit myself with it in my brand new necklace. At least my necklace is okay. So, um, yeah, it's sturdy. I'm probably freaking out my dad downstairs. He's probably like, you okay? Do I need to check on you? He's not yelling anything, but I wouldn't be half surprised if he comes up and knocks on the door anytime now and be like, dude, you okay? Uh, yeah. Hey, I cracked it. Awesome. So I guess it's not that sturdy. Are we seeing the crack? And yeah, I know, my ratchet ass self only has polish on one hand, because that's how far I got before I hit the point of fuck that too, so, deal with it. Uh, anyway, um, I'm sorry, I'm in a mood today. If you don't like it, click out of this video and try another one and hope I'm in a better mood than that one, but this video, I'm gonna be a moody little bitch, okay? It, it is my right, and I'm being a moody bitch, so. Um, special features, it, it has vitamins. Fucking awesome. Also fucking awesome. Alright. Okay. Um, it's not medicated. It just is what it is. I don't want to smell it. I know what it smells like and it smells bad, but I have to do it. Also, it's like sweating on the side and is really gross. Like, can we see this crap? It's really... Ew. At least it's the last review where I have to smell one of these, so I'm, I'm just... I'm making myself do it. I'm making myself suck it up, just do it one more time. We don't have to talk about them anymore, and that'll be that. Until, like, the end of the year when I do my worst of the worst list, but... You know, next to each other, they don't look that different, but I bet you they don't go on anything similar to one another, so... Let's find out! Yeah, no. This is way more purpley red. Or if you know, maroon! That is a color that exists! Yeah, it's really uneven and crappy. Let's put it on! I'm going to regret this and I don't give a shit. So I don't give a shit about anything today. Ah! Fuck! Well, with one swipe, that's what it looks like. Tastes terrible. Mm -mm -mm. I pretend it is the blood of my enemies. Yeah, yeah, I'm in that kind of fucked up mood today, okay? Just d don't even fuck with me today. <sighs> like, haters started on me. There will probably be, like, a legit fight in the comments. I'm not even joking. Which I realize is probably an open invitation to- I don't even fucking give a fuck. I'm kinda in the mood for just fucking bring it. I'll end you, but... This is turning into a very interesting review very quickly. I'm so sorry. Sorry, but not sorry, if I'm being honest.
But if I'm being very, very honest, I kind of do just want to fight with someone right now. So just, yeah, you probably shouldn't leave hate unless you want to fight. In which case, I might fight. But, um... Hmm. Hmm. Let's try. Hmm. Doesn't really help it. Fuck. Well, certain dark reds work for me. Certain ones, I mean, it's not terrible. It, it's a wearable color. I'm just not feeling it. Just, I don't know what I was expecting. I mean, looking at that color, I knew it was going to be hella dark. I mean, honestly, it's probably better on me than the bright, bright red, but... Same time, I'm kind of just like I'm, I'm fucking over it. I'm I'm over it. Uh, it's also not helping that it's got that nasty ass grittiness to it. That is definitely like the powdered up vitamins, and I'm like, can we just not? Like, please, can we just not have that be a thing? It is fucking gross as shit. Tastes hella gross. Smells hella gross. I am not into it in the slightest. I just ugh. I don't like this line. And it makes me very happy I didn't waste 20 bucks a pop for the actual, what is it, the Sephora brand ones that these are a ripoff of. Because my sister says, yeah, they smell pretty much just like this. And I'm like, well, if they smell just like that, well, fuck that. I don't want any part of it. I will not be doing that mess again. So, yeah. Um, but the actual thickness is very thin. Consistency is not very even. Like, some of it, you can even see where it's darker in some spots than others. That's because it's thicker in those spots than others. Just like, oh yeah, the back of my hand. But, um, these, they don't fucking moisturize. I've tried them all. They don't moisturize for me. Maybe they do for you. For me, they don't. But, um, shine factor, it, it has some shine. That, that's cool. You can see how much I give a shit. I told you, I'm just so over this damn brand. I just do not even... Oh yeah, kiss test. Boom. Fail. Hmm. Drink test. I wonder how it will do. Ew. And I swear to god, if you ever crush up a pill like an aspirin or something, that texture is like, what is in this? That is probably why I hate it so much. Ugh, ugh. Ew, that, that gulp of it had like a shit ton of, of the, ugh, ugh, ugh. Ew. Ew. I'm changing straws after this video because I cannot. And then I'm also washing those off. Just, ugh. And, yeah, you can see right there, it's already starting to come off, so it fails that too! Awesome! So, hmm. <coughs> Excuse me, I just choked on my own spit. So, what am I gonna rate it? I don't know, how about a negative 20,000? Um, seriously though, I'm gonna dock at a point for being fucking expensive for a shit-ass product. Um... Talk at a point for the nasty grittiness, another point for the nasty smell, another point for the nasty taste, another point for not passing the drink test, another one for not passing the kiss test. Um, it's not even coverage. It just... I'm being generous, giving it a 3 out of 10. I feel like it does not even honestly deserve that, but... I'm gonna give it to it just because I'm tired of thinking about it. I don't want to. I don't want to look at it ever again. I don't want to look at any of these ever again. I'm putting them in a bag. I'm burying them at the bottom of the lip balm crate. And that is going to be where they will just rot. So, yeah. It's not even like one of the lip balms where if I don't like the scent or something, I can use it as like a moisturizer stick on my body. No, because they're fucking tinted. So I can't even do that with them. So if anybody has uh, ideas on repurposing tinted lip balms, uh, you know, throw that shit at me, because as is, not using that again. Which sucks, because color's not terrible, even though I'm not feeling it today, I could see this being a color I might like if I were in a better mood, but I'm kind of just in the fuck everything and everyone and I just hate the world right now moods, so yeah, that.
This is awkward. So, I'm going to end this video. If you like this video, which I don't imagine anybody did because I'm being a bitch, go ahead and hit the like button. Or don't. I don't give a fuck. Um, if you want to see more to my bitchy ass, go ahead and click the subscribe button. I swear to God, I'm not always like this. I'm usually not like this. Just, this is one random example. If I film again later today, I will try to keep my ass in check and be in a better mood. But for right now, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm just having a moment. Uh, and it unfortunately coincided with when I decided to film. But, um... And you should probably hit the bell icon so you get a notification of when I do upload again and hopefully I'm in a better mood than I am right now. Uh, you should leave comments down below telling me to stop being a bitch or, you know, anything else you feel like leaving me. Like, if you have this one, how much you like it or hate it or what the fuck ever else you feel like. This is probably gonna get demonetized for how much swearing's in it. Oh well. Uh, <laughs> look at how many fucks I give. Look at how many fucks I've said. Hmm. <laughs> I just. I am so over it today. I'm just over today. Period. Just. Uh, huh, yeah, I made a period joke without meaning to. Huh, so funny. I told you, I am just in the I hate everything mood, so. You've been warned. You have been warned. But, um. Yeah that. Um, if you feel like leaving me positivity in hopes that it'll rub off on me, that would also be greatly appreciated. It'd probably be better than picking a fight with me just because I'm in the mood for it. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that. So, I'm just gonna end this before I keep talking out of my ass saying more shit I'm probably gonna regret later, so bye.